And good morning, boys and girls. I got my cup, uh, my hot tea here. And it's a cold morning, but nice. And usually I don't dress up. I wear something like this behind me, a uh, cami coat. And that's going to be another video for today. Today is conspiracy theory story time. We're doing Illuminati groups A and B. Illuminati groups A and B are opposing forces in the Illuminati organization. They've been fighting over a couple thousand years over the control of the planet Earth. Uh, they branched off, each group has branched off into subgroups and subgroups and subgroups and so on and so on until everybody is fighting everybody. Um, okay, uh, question on Illuminati group A. Yes, most conservatives and Republicans belong to this group. And yes, they also freed the slaves. Both in Moses' time and also Abraham Lincoln's time. Uh, Illuminati Group B. Yes, they're Democrats, uh, Adolf Hitler, um, social justice workers, BLM. They're the opposites of, like I said, it's too confusing. It's a lot of, a lot of nuts. Anyway, all these subgroups are fighting each other for control of the earth. Or control of your money. Let me get a filter for the light. Sorry about that, folks. There. How's that? That looks a little better. Low-tech sample. Okay. Uh, they've been doing this for 2,000 years, trying to control the world. Uh, everybody's fighting everybody. Typical Illuminati fashion. That's why you can't trust anybody. There's no such thing as the good guys in white hats. You get close with the tan hats, but everybody's wearing a black hat. Uh, if the Democrats or Socialists Anybody say, we're the good guys. Run away. Go the other direction or head out. Run away. Uh, let's see more questions. Are they a danger? Yes, to you and your loved ones. What are their goals? They want to take all your money away. They want you to make you as slaves. They want you to brainwash you. Uh, no, Illuminati Group A lost control of colleges and the media. That went to uh, Illuminati Group B. They took over the colleges and the media and Hollywood and certain factions of our government. If you want to see something true, go to any college campus. Just walk through it, smile, say hello to the students, and check it out for yourself and see... It's basically um, a brainwashing machine to be, uh, I'm going to follow this certain pattern of thinking. Not open-minded, just I'm going to be like this. Uh, it's like the Nazis have taken over, or socialists taken over everybody, and brainwashed them. Well, give them their own opinions. Let them decide. You don't. You can't say everybody has to be this kind of role model. Uh, that's that's kind of true because if you look at Illuminati Group B, they always want you to speak up. And later on they put you on the death list or hit list and get rid of you quietly. That's kind of funny. Every political group that swings towards that direction instead of the other direction will put you on a list as an enemies list and eliminate you quietly. Both sides do it, but it's mostly on the B side. Yes, Illuminati groups are still in power. They're all over the place. And right now they're in business and also in government. Mostly in Canada for the government in Mexico. And for business, it's the four horsemen in the United States. Apple, Amazon, Google, 
Let me see Apple, Amazon, Google. Apple, Amazon, Google, and YouTube, I think. Anyway, they're the four horsemen, and yes, the Illuminati groups are in there, and they're always posed as progressive. Go look at Gula. And ask them why they hire descendants of Project Paperclip. You know those skate Nazi scientists and politicians? Gee, a lot of people didn't know about that. Also, Trudeau in Canada. Ask them about the Nazis Descendants of Nazis he hired to run his police programs in Canada. Uh, it, it's like, yes, our secu church security force or temple security force are formerly SS. Great. I see a lot of uh, Jewish people going, eh, eh. Now, uh... You know, that's kind of insensitive, but it's true. You know, you have to be careful nowadays, boys and girls. And like I said, they're both active and they got a lot of subgroups. So be very careful. Catch you later. You have a nice day. This is Diablo Frog 79 Olin Cloud. You have a nice one.